Hey guys, this is Guy Technology, and today I'm going to be showing you 15 City of Tweaks that I use every single day on my iPod Touch 4th generation, and they are compatible with all the iOS 6 versions and the iPhone 5 and such. And I've tried to pick out tweaks that you may not know about, so stay tuned, and I will have all the repos for these tweaks in the description. So, the first City of Tweak I'm going to be showing you about is not really a useful tweak but it just looks nice on iOS so this tweak is called battery shower and what it basically does is even if you're not charging you can put your battery on your lock screen so if you don't have a lock screen theme or something like that this is this just looks pretty cool by itself so the next tweak kind of adds to that it's called animate battery and animate battery um when you're um batteries charging or like dying it shows a little animation that moves back and forth and you can and there's settings for this in the um, settings app of your iPod now the next city of tweak I'm going to be showing you is called any lock app so this allows you to put any app here not just the camera on your lock screen so when you want click quick access to this app you just swipe up where your camera would normally be and it opens directly the app so I used messages or text plus and put it there because I want quick access to my messages so that's pretty nice now the next city of tweak I'm gonna be showing you is called app locker so when you go into your settings and because there's not an actual app for this you go into your settings and you scroll down when you download this you're allowed to set locks to your apps and folders and there's also some settings in here so I'm just gonna turn this on and show you what I mean so I have let's say my mail locked whenever you do that it opens up a password so people can't enter into your mail if you don't want them to or any other app which you specify in the settings so the next city of tweak I'm going to be showing you is OXO. And OXO is um, a beautiful lock screen, I mean app switcher, that they should have implemented on iOS in the first place. So, um, so here when you open it up it shows you a live image of what your app is like right now. And, um, and to close out of the app you just swipe down. And you can also use multi-touch fingers. I know it's kind of hard to show you, but you can use two fingers at once and swipe down. And if you want to delete all the apps at once, you you click yes or no. And this is also compatible with App Locker. See, when I open an app, it still pops up because I've tested this. And it also has a bunch of toggles like SB settings when you sw scroll all the way to the right. And it also has a brightness bar. So I think that's pretty cool. Now the next city of tweak I'm going to be showing you guys is called Dashboard X and this allows you to place widgets on your home screen. Now to place a widget you hold down like you would be hold, holding down to delete an app and then you hold down again and then it should bring up a screen with a bunch of widgets which you can download from Cydia. There's a special section for that. So you go ahead and do that and then you just click one. Let's say I want to do NC Mail which allows you to send mail from your home screen add widget and here it is it just pops up now the next city of tweak I'm going to be showing you guys is something that complements this and it's called I blank so as you can see right now I have widgets they're almost like floating right now they're above my apps because normally you these don't replace apps so what I mean is these apps when you move them if you don't have um, the special tweak they can go behind these apps and it looks really ugly so this is called iBlank and it what it basically does is adds blank icons to your home screen so there is an app which you can go into it's right there but I don't really have enough time to show you that but I can basically show you what it does is it when you do that when you add the icons it has a bunch of like blank icons which you can put and then once you click out of it you can't even see them so you can add widgets on top of your apps if that if you wish to do so 
So the next city trick I'm going to be showing you guys is called Flip Over. And Flip Over basically allows you, um, to, when you turn your iPod on a flat surface, it automatically um, puts it into sleep mode for you. So I think it's pretty cool if you're just lazy and you're and you want to just sleep your iPod. So it's it's just a cool little tweak. So the next city tweak I'm going to be showing you guys is called Folder Enhancer. And Folder Enhancer, it allows you to um, have multiple apps, as many as you want, inside a folder. And it also allows you to have folders inside folders. So it's kind of like fo Folderception. And um, I think that's pretty cool. So the next city tweak I'm going to be showing you guys is called Icon Renamer. And when you hold down and you double tap an icon, um, it pops up a little message and you can rename the icon to whatever you want. This is good for themers, like if you have like five icon springboard and the words just don't fit together, you can abbreviate them. And the next city tweak I'm going to be showing you guys is called lock screen rotator so when you're on your lock screen normally when you turn it to its side it doesn't move but with this tweak it does and it's totally functional you can move it upside down left to right so it's a pretty cool and um, now the tweak when you download it it says you can double tap the battery to, to make it so you can't turn it, but I found that that respringed your iPod, so this is one of the only tweaks that still has problems on iOS 6. Now the next city of tweak I'm going to be showing you guys is called Springtimize. And um, Springtimize, what it basically does is replaces a lot of mini tweaks and puts it all into one big tweak. I'll show you what I mean. So when I open it up, it showed these are everything you can do. Now I'm not, I can't really go into depth about all about it. I might do a video later. But you can change animations, you can change capabilities, you can change icons, disable jittering, that's one of the things I have on there. So when you hold down an iPod to delete it, it doesn't jitter. And all these to sorts of things, so it's pretty much a basic tweak everyone should have. You may have heard about it um, before, it's, it's a lot of people know about it. So, the next city of tweak I'm going to be showing you guys is called upside down and basically what it allows you to do is when you have an app open let's say videos wait for this to load when you have an app open it allows you to turn upside down and still use the app so normally on iOS your screen would just be upside down you'd look retarded but now you can just you know move your iPod into any orientation you want and um, again, you if you want to like disable this, you can do it in the settings, or you can just go into and lock portrait um, orientation. Now, the last tweak I'm going to be showing you guys is called Zephyr, and this is an awesome tweak, which kind of makes your iPod like an iPad in a sense, with multi-touch gestures and such. And um, it's also good if your home button's broken. Mine isn't currently broken, but I just um, I appreciate the usefulness of this tweak. So, there's a ton of different settings you can do, but like one of them is like I have it so that I can pull up my app switcher using my finger, which is kind of like what you can do on um, on the iPad. And there's also other stuff like I'm not going to show it to you right now, but if you're in an app, you can swipe over and get to the next app, and swipe over and get to the next app. And when you opened an app. You can also swipe up to get rid of the app as if um, you were using the home button. So it's pretty cool tweak if your if your home button's broken or you just like the fluidity of the touch screen in it. I haven't noticed any errors that hasn't resprung on me yet, so and that's all the city of tweaks I have for you guys. I'm gonna be doing a video I hope soon on different widgets you can put on your home screen new old widgets and um but i can only do that if you guys give me a thumbs up and i see that this video gets support because i'm just starting this channel and i want to know if you guys like these vids so um I'll Girl, talk to you guys later. The profession when you write rhyme Caught me and she told me I'm a pig like I fight crime Well, maybe G is just an ass
asshole Fuck around with bitches, alfalfa little rascal Swear my intentions aren't as evil as you think But temptations always pushing people